Today we will use Gemini 3 Pro AI model and with this using this model we will build this type of one of the interactive web application. So if you are ready then let's get started. Hello friend welcome back. As you know Gemini 3 Pro is available right now. Now in this video I will check out this and here I will build one of the application and I want to review it how these things actually work. For doing this you have to go to Google AI Studio and here that will be their link. I want to go first of all their site and that will be on the welcome page and into this welcome page here um, simply I return redirect to that our their page and here you will find that our build option if you go to that our build and you can see right now the model as a Gemini 3 Pro view. So I want to do, I want to check it. So here, if you already know friend, by this you can build different type of games also, it will be different type of web application, backend application, each and everything you can actually generate it. I want to do before I have used it as uh, Gemini 2. So right now that is also provided Gemini uh, 3 Pro is right recently one. So the Gemini 2.5 Pro also available. Now I want to check out the Gemini 3 Pro preview what type of things is updated, what type of things that will be look like, everything I want to check it. And also there is a system infractions template, what type of template you want to use. You, if you want to use that react template, you can use it react template if you can choose that as an angular also. But right now react is fine for me, I want to select it as a react and here now I want to check it, I want to put some of the simple prompt code here I have already write down this prompt code like I want to build a one single page website it should be personal portfolio landing page make it a look like a Silicon Valley startup with a lot of sections including header footer in header should be menus logging register button it should be I include my expert expertise work portfolio client and blog very simple one of the prompt code now throughout this I want to do I want to build it and as you know that is totally free if you have that one uh, Google account and after that locking you will also get that free API integration related everything is in available in here rather than if you working to the very vast type of one of the project then you can also able to purchase their token that means API key you can actually um, get it from to this our gate API key but now I want to do, I want to uh, use that their embedded API key. I put this one and click as a build and now that will be started to work. So I want to check out what type of things uh, actually that will be built in here. And as you see, it's already thinking. Now we are using that Gemini 3 Pro preview and it's already start to work. So what type of preview we will receive? I want to do, I want to check out it. So it may take little time here. You have to wait a little bit. And here you can see our total portfolio web application is successfully created, which is also look like great, right? It's also look like great. And here, if you also check out that in a full screen, so that will be our full screen. And that is look like this. Hmm, not bad. It successfully created all that our sections, the our work sections. I want to do, I want to make it a little bit professional. So here I want to go back to that again. And here I want to do, I want to use some of the animations. I want to put it as a add some animation, animation like as a laser, laser a light in hero section. Okay. And also um, make this full side look professional. Okay. Just make it as a look like a professional so now that's fine so i want to do to add some of the another tips is in here i want to done to click as a go so now i added as i add one animations laser light in hero section that means that it will be our hero sections area i want to add one of the laser light animation and also i want to make total our web application look like a slide um, full side should be as a professional let's check this out what type of update version it will be create okay here actually is very interactive how much easy nowadays you can see so friend if you have any interest to learn ai based SaaS application you can also check out my personal website as easylearningpd.com where you will get multiple ai related courses especially as a master build real ai application with llm 
like in that uh, one of the course here actually i have discussed about how can create that very advanced level sas application like that will be as a ai as in chatbot sas application that will be a website builder sas application with using that group api gemini api then uh chat gpt api and recently i have i will also added another ai project that will be one of the prom optimizer with the group api so here actually you will learn how to integrate different type of apis in your real project and throughout this how can then generate that uh, total entire project everything you will learn it by that is all the project based course you can see they have the nine about that 92 hours and 109 sections so that is a sections a lot of the lectures is in here so you can also check out this if you are have an interested to learn about how to uh, working with the llm especially the cloud api the group api the chat gpt api and also the gemini api you can check out this now and to go back to the here and now it's already getting some of the error and now it's already trying to fix it and here as i see it successfully updated our applications little bit to that our professional way but here is still now that is look like this okay here i want to do and here if you want to check it in our full screen right now hmm it's much better it's much better and it's look like the same okay here only this position is actually updated in particular that position especially into the work section so here that is a work section everything is fine so i want to do i want to make it as a dark okay dark version what type of things i want to check it here i want to make it as a not that blue i want to make i want i want to make full okay full website as green green okay green version version and total oh, total website that should be sorry that should be should be uh, light or, or the dark version okay, i want to use it as a dark version let's check this out i want to go into update again i just put this command so now throughout this command you can not only develop that one page you can also edit that multiple pages like if you want to add that create another page in your portfolio area that will be also executed so here then that should be also work fine in here but now i want to do to check it by the simple prompt so here actually if you put that very interactive prompt then that will be give you more interactive things okay so then that will be actually give you very interactive web application but you can see it's already added one of the laser light friends here you can see one of the lighting is actually passing throughout this which is very interactive like here actually if you noticed here they have one of the lighting is passing that means you successfully added that our laser light animations also you can see that is a laser light animation is also working but it's not very in deep if you want to make it as a deep then it, that should be also possible just you have to put it as a prompt friend here <laughs> that will be all perfect you can see now it's much much better here i have updated that version color now here i selected as a that should be as a dark mode and then i have also changed it blue to the green and now it's created one of the green theme version perfect perfect you can see how much interactive it is so not only that our web application as i told you here if you want to add the different type of section like if you want to add the different type of client testimonial section you have to do you have to add that as a testimonial section then that should be also added another sections in here for the testimonial so you can do now everything only you have to do you have to add that prompt code what type of prompt you want to add you can actually add it in here and also they are suggested what type of things you want to add as a add project filter if you want to add and enhance the blog post implement the scroll to the top button so everything you can actually do it so as i told you that will be depends on you what type of prompt you have actually added so in my other video if you already watch i have already put a lot of the very advanced level uh, in details prompt code and here actually if you use it you will get much more big better result from it okay because now actually that is much uh, faster from to the 2.5 and here you can do everything in very fastly and also much more than very professional and you can see there is a laser his light is also working which is i do like it personally so much 
and if you want to add implemented and other things you can also be able to implement it. so now i want to do like that is the laser light if you want to make it like it's, i want laser a uh, laser a light should be fall down down the or double right fall down from to the top and uh, from to the top to down okay or fall down from to the top i want to make it from to the top and it should be okay it should be as green a uh, green color color mm, like as water fall okay i fell for so i want to do and to use this one as a waterfall fall fall okay waterfall now let's check this out i want to also update it the laser light that should be look like much better and here you can see it's actually also working that is the laser light is working if you go to that fully skin that is also successfully working perfect perfect and not only that if you actually also check out this in in different way like here res if you go to that 24 or fast date top components that is a 20 fast date and here actually they have also very interactive uh, some of the background and here actually i want to do to search it like here i want to use it as a laser laser one of the template is available in here i want to do to check out it you can see that is actually a laser template here if you open this one and here actually you can get every information from it like what type of things is in here if you go to that open in new tab and that is actually look like this hmm much better right this is much better so if you go and if you go to that start now that is our one of the theme triangle for the dark mode at the light mode and here that is our copy prompt there is also another option for the copy this prompt i want to copy it I copy this total prom from here and now if you go back to that here i want to do update okay update the header uh, or the hero section hero section section like this okay here i paste this prompt and you can see it's already giving you total prompt code and now i simply added that prompt code from here simply go to that uh 21st tab and here search it with the laser and here the, you will for every component you will get this type of one of the option for the copy prompt so you can also copy this prompt and now i just simply paste this prompt directly in here now let's check this out i want to just update okay make it as a here just you can just update this one so now let's check this out i want to do to check it i want to make it as a send prompt all that our prompt is now send it now let's check this out what type of things that will be do in here our implementation process i want to check out it and as i see it's not actually working right maybe that is the component that is up to have some of the prompt for using this one it's maybe not working fine into this our area that means in our uh, google gemini at uh, three it's not working fine i want to make it as a i didn't i didn't see any laser a laser l yeah s yeah right that will be here i have used it on the laser focus okay i just used it as a laser focus i didn't see any laser focus in my header or in my hero section hero section would you please recheck this again i want here that should be should be um, one laser focus animation okay like animation or like right now i want to do to just simply add it this one again so now i want to use it i want to check out it again successfully working or not because here that should be now display this type of one of the laser focus component right that means this one will be actually display but somehow if not working it's fine but here actually if you go to that to the uh, fast dot tape here actually there are a lot of uh, material that is component ready-made component you can also able to use it here you can choose that 
and background they have the different type of background they have the different type of call to actions the compare the hero section the feature section if you select it all the ready-made component is available in here you can also implement it that all that component in your react project so if you have any interest to learn how to use that 21st day component in your real react project let me know about into the comment section i will also create another video for this how can create it how can implementation everything in your react project i will also create another video for you okay but now we are testing it in our gemini 3 point pro preview here i think that is not working before but I simply updated also another section. Let's check how it's working or not. Overall, rather than if you want to create that our full application, full application is already fine. And also all that our code, necessary code, you can see it's already working into this our code section. All that our component is in here. What type of component he is actually using. Every resources you can actually able to get it from to this position. Everything is ready made in here. If you want to save this application, you can save it. Not only that, if you want to download this total file, whatever the file format is actually generated, you can also be able to download it, you can share it, uh, save it to your GitHub account. Every functionality, everything is available. You can see, everything is available in here. You can download directly in your local host and you can also run this application in front of your local host. So every process is in here. So now, all that is our preview version is also updated. It's as I as I checking it, it's already updated that function. Let's check this out. What type of things that should be look like? Yes, you can see now that's the great news. <laughs> our what is the expectation we are expecting? That is successfully working. If you go to that our full screen, wow, it's really incredible. One of the laser light is falling like as a water. You can see. Our total hero section is now become very, very professional. How much interactive? Great. So our total application is ready, falling down that everything is working successful. So if you want to change that our color, font, everything, you can handle it throughout our chat comment. That means chat box. Okay. But I, that is very challenging work. So now here we are also able to successfully use this laser light. You can see the same laser light animation. You can also implement it in here. And as I told you here, you will get a lot of the component as per your demand. What type of component you want to use it. You can choose this component if you open it. And here you will get that our copy prompt. Simply copy this prompt and use it in your project. You can also able to use it. But right now, I think that's look like great. That's the things we are expecting it. I do personally like it so much. And I hope you get some idea. If you want to develop any type of project, you can now develop everything from here. And also, as I told you, all that your code material, you can also be able to get access it from to these positions. If you want to save it, you can save it. You can copy this app. You can also download it. You can also save it to the GitHub account. Everything is in here. So this project is in under the live version. So now here, now this look like great. So you can now download it and you can use it in your real project. You can make all the part one by one as a dynamic. So that will be depends on you. But your very interactive work is successfully done. So what you are thinking about the Gemini 3, let me know about into these comments. So if you like my video, make sure you subscribe my channel and stay tuned with me. Happy coding and thanks for watching.